Hey there, this is uh, Brian here. I uh, just wanted to uh, show you how to download for free uh, Yahoo Finance data into your Microsoft Excel worksheet. I came across this uh, really cool little uh, Google Code project, Finance Data to Excel. Um, works us through an add-in. Um, so when you come to this URL, uh, you will be able to see the installation instructions, which are, uh, I'm going to just go to that right now. Uh, it's very simple. Uh, when you do a download, uh, you'll be referred to this XLA file. Um, from there, you need to take that XLA file that you download, put it into this folder, in your uh, system, your documents, application, data, Microsoft add-ins. From there, when you go into Excel, it should be able to see the add-in. So under your Start button in Office Excel, you should be able to do this. Uh, Excel Options, and then come under your add-ins, under your inactive application add-ins, you'll see your finance data to Excel. Uh, to manage this list, just come under Excel Add-ins, uh, choose Excel Add-ins, that is. Go, pop-up displays, add-ins do display as well. Choose your finance data to Excel. That will activate it, as in here. And then once you have that, you should be able to see this tab, your add-ins tab, which will enable your add-in, your Yahoo data tab and then you should be able to use it so in this case I can do a get history on the single ticket or single ticker here's all your parameters so in my case I could have pretty well any uh, whatever symbol Yahoo tracks so in this case uh, this OMX da 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 start date range frequency monthly daily output range all the different uh, parameters I want and then you just do a download let me just clear all this crap out uh, do it again so boom boom all the same parameters and there you go that's pretty cool um, hopefully I'll help you out